In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly save the assets for your template to use in your PhotoBoost software from inside Photoshop CS3 or higher. I am using uh, Photoshop CC, so it may look a little different than yours. First thing we need to do is open up our template.psd file, and this will give us our uh, design to work with. For this one, I'm going to uh, make some modifications. Uh, with continue or consider these a uh, bride request so let's say she's using a, a wine backdrop and I went ahead and added a, a layer just on the overlay and some purple here once we made these changes we can't reuse what was given to us which is here and here because we've changed it so we need to proceed to uh, save the new assets so to do so is very quick and easy um, I'm going to first hide everything except for the text layers and the uh, overlay.png layers. And then I'm going to do a file save just to save my PSD and then a save as. I'm going to select a PNG. I'm just going to overwrite my overlay.png here. I use small, smallest and then interlaced seems to work well in most of the boost softwares out there. Next we need to uh, hide those layers and we'll just have the uh, background to give us everything else. This we're going to save as a JPEG so we'll do save as, select JPEG and then we're going to overwrite our background.jpg. I use 10, um, 12 seems to be overkill it really bumps the uh, file size which will um, affect the rendering speed on some uh, slower machines. So 10 seems to be a good uh, compromise of quality and uh, file size. We'll do a save there and we'll go look and we've got a new background and a new overlay. We can copy these into our PhotoBoost software, uh, whichever you're using, and then um, you will now have an updated set of files to use at your event. 